Hi, I'm Gil Hova, and I'd like to show you how to play my game, The Networks. In The Networks, you're a TV network executive, and you're trying to get the best programming over the course of five seasons. The player with the most viewers at the end of five seasons wins. So the first thing that's important to know here is that all the components you're going to see here are prototype components. Uh, the quality is going to be a little nicer in the final version of the game. This is what we're testing with. Also, the graphic design is mostly done, but the illustrations are still being worked on as of the shooting this video. So the components you're going to see are not going to have any of the final art uh, that's going to be available by the time you probably see this video. So with that said, let's start setting up the game. So let's start with the game board. So the game board comes in three, uh, three pieces. This is the first piece, and this piece also has a little season track that tells you what season you're currently in, and obviously we're going to start in season one of five. Uh, then the next part of the player board has a turn order track, and uh, we're gonna randomize a turn order here for four players. So let's just randomly put out four turn order markers. Excellent. So the third part of the player board depends on how many people you're playing with. So the game's going to come with five different playing boards. See there's one player, two player, three players, and they're all slightly different, like the one player scoreboard is a little bit different than the three player scoreboard, it's a little different from the four, and that's a little different than the five. So we're playing a four player game here, so let's uh, choose the four player board and we're going to slide that right over here. And now the board is set up. Now all we have to do is get everybody's score markers on the board here. And now you see we have a little bit of a legend that tells us what goes around the board. So we're going to set that up now. We have seven show cards, five star cards, four ads, and four network cards. Now one thing about these network cards, they're power cards, and they add a little bit of extra juice to the game. And if you haven't played before, you're actually not going to play with the network cards in the first season. So I'm only going to deal out the stars, the ads, and the shows because I'm going to assume a basic game. Uh, in the first season, you don't play with the network cards. I'll show you what the network cards actually do a little bit later in this video. All right, we have dealt out all our cards. We have star cards, ads, and shows. And we're going to just dolly over here and you're going to get to see this whole board over here. It's pretty straightforward. And we set this board up exactly as the player board told us. We have seven shows, five stars, and four ads. Now that we're done with the main setup, let's look at your individual player area. Everybody's gonna get one of these player boards and uh, the Kickstarter campaign is going to let you actually pledge a certain amount to name a network. So five people, if they pledge enough money, will be able to name one of the five networks in the game. So this is your network board, and it's got a little bit of player information over here. It also has your three time slots, 8 p.m., 9 p.m., and 10 p.m. has a green room for your stars and ads, and you actually start the game with one star and one ad. So let's set that up, up, up right now. There we go, there's our starter ad and our starter star. And the reason these prototype cards say starter is because uh, that's another thing you can name in the Kickstarter campaign. And uh, then you, of course, have your starting shows. Now, the thing about your starting shows is since you're a beginning network, your shows are not going to be very good. So in our particular game, we're going to start with uh, Get to Know Your Lower Colon. Uh, at 8 o'clock. Let's Pickle will be on at 9, and wrapping up our schedule will be the biannual county bubble wrap popping tournament. This isn't exactly compelling television over here. As you can see, each of these three shows will net us exactly zero viewers, and we're just going to mark that with these cubes over here, and we've got a fourth cube, and you'll see its purpose a little bit later in the video. So red is actually going to be second in turn order here. You can see that because you've got red over here, that's second. And the second player will start out with $7. Now, this again is a prototype, so 
Um, I have been prototyping with poker chips. Uh, the money is actually going to be really nice punch board money. But let's get $7 worth of poker chips uh, ahead of us. And now we've got our $7 and we are ready to start the game.